Hello and welcome to The Spoke Unit. My name is Paul Anthony and in today's video I've got the honor and pleasure to introduce you to Damien's work from Bespoke Leather where we have both the pocket and desktop lighters here that are ideal for lighting cigars. So on a recent trip back home to London, I was very fortunate to be able to meet Damien and go and explore his workshops in South London where he creates all of his bespoke leather pieces. Of particular interest to me were the cigar lighters for uh, obvious reasons, but he also manufactures and crafts many other fantastic leather goods. So I definitely implore you to check out the link below, not only for these particular lighters in question, but also some of the other fantastic leather work that he does as well. He's got a pretty insane pedigree and heritage, and I don't want to share too much, but he's worked for some pretty big French fashion fashion houses as well as big fashion houses in London and now he has got his own studio and you can buy directly from the maker himself. So first of all I just want to show you the pocket lighters. Uh, with respect to price points if you get that out there initially they range from £99 to £165 and I'm filming this here in August 2022 so with the current exchange rate that's about $120 to $200 and the price point differential basically boils down to the different lever options. So as you can see in front of me, I have three of the different pocket lighter options in a lever, a stingray, and also a crocodile as well. And depending on the different types of lever is going to, is going to be what dictates the respective price point. One of the things that I really like about the pocket lighters is not only their size, but also that they have an integrated punch in the bottom of the lighter itself so you can always uh, be ready to uh, punch your cigars and then the other side of the lighter is where you're going to put more fuel into it as well as change the flame height as well so what damien does is he gets these uh these raw uh lighters and then he wraps them uh, in the particular lever as well all very fine high-end uh, craftsmanship right from London, England. Also, I wanted to mention in the box, uh, the presentation uh, for a start is fantastic. You're going to get one of these burgundy boxes here from Damien and Bespoke Leather. It's going to come wrapped in some nice ribbon. However, I've already taken all of that off because I've been happily uh, using these lighters myself. But what's also included in the box is uh, additional flints because this is a flint lighter that you're going to pop open as well as a uh, convenient little carry bag as well. So if it's in your pocket, the, uh, the fine levers are not gonna be damaged by keys or cell phone, etc. So the other option uh, available is the uh, desktop lighter. And you can see there is quite a significant uh, differential. The one thing I really do like about the additional size is how good it feels in the hand. And there's also a, a slight uh, curve to the, the piece as well, which makes it nice to hold. Again, flint lighter, same setup. The price for these particular lighters ranges from 150 pounds to 285 pounds. And at today's current exchange rate, that's gonna be $180 to around $350. Again, that's gonna be contingent on current exchange rates. Uh, the difference here also is that the tabletop lighter only has access to change the flame height and refill with butane. There is no additional punch cutter, etc. So pretty much what I'm going to talk about the pros and cons of these lighters is going to be for both individual sizes outside of the obvious benefit of having the aforementioned punch in the pocket size lighter as well. However, I suppose if you're at home and you've got a tabletop lighter, you're going to have other cigar accoutrements such as cutters that you probably don't have to have integrated. So it is a nice feature, especially on the, the pocket size lighter. What I like about these lighters is they're a little bit old school. They've got that flint feel. And beyond that, what is really the unique selling point is the fact that each and every one is completely unique and individual, whether it's different levers or whether it's customized, like you can see here on this one where we had 15 units uh, produced for a whiskey club that I'm a member of in Philadelphia and all the members have loved the quality um, as well as the performance of the lighters because after we smoke, uh, after we drink, we, uh, we occasionally smoke as well. 
Uh, other pros of it are the fact that I absolutely love to support uh, artisans and Damien is a fantastic guy, really got on with him well, got fantastic stories and most importantly, a pure passion for what he does working with leather. So I can't stress that enough that the guy just oozes leather and passion for what he does. So that's obviously a great thing to do and support. Not only that, you can get custom designs, custom levers, custom embossing, whatever you want, he'll work with you on it. So that's what I really like about Damien and the product that he's putting out there for people. With respect to the cons, uh, I don't really find too many cons. These particularly lighters have a specific use for a specific time. I'm not gonna take this on the golf course for obvious reasons. I'm not gonna try and put this the tabletop lighter in a waistcoat pocket. You know, these are aesthetically pleasing lighters. They may not be the highest performing lighters, but they're very pleasing on the eye. They're very unique, and you can also get them customized as well. The only one slight criticism I do have of the uh, lighters in actuality is sometimes the flame height when you fill in with fresh butane, and I use Zycar high performance butane, is sometimes the flame height gets quite extreme. So I would say as long as you've got like a handy little tool such as a Zycar moldy tool or small screwdriver, you're just gonna to wanna to turn that flame down. And unfortunately, it's not as easy as say like an Estée de Pont de Fay where there's a nice wheel on the bottom. You've actually gotta get kind of a, a flathead uh, kind of screwdriver in there to, to tone that down. So that's the only real con of these units that I've faced. But having owned these now for several months and some of them for longer than that, uh, I'm extremely happy and as you can see, uh, my collection has started to grow a little bit as well. So there we have it. I hope you really enjoyed the review of uh, the bespoke leather lighters I've got in front of me, both the tabletop and pocket lighter version as well. Please check out the description below where I'm gonna be a link directly to bespoke leather and Damien. Also, there'll probably be a few other links in there uh, relating to other videos we have on Bespoke, you know, not only in the cigar space, but please feel free to check out the rest of the site as well as YouTube for much more men's lifestyle content around men's fragrances, cigars, shoes, suits, travel, and much, much more. Please leave any comments below if anything relating to the video or any other topics you'd like us to cover, as well as like the video and subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications for the aforementioned plethora of men's lifestyle content that we cover here at Bespoke Unit. With all of that being said, I hope you buy some of these lighters from Damien and support a true artisan, and I'll see you in the next one.